to cooking with Gloria today I want to share with you a very creamy and delicious popsicle in a bag of eggnog or as I call it rompope it is perfect for this hot weather and you know something it comes out amazing but first things first my apron is on my hands are clean and I am ready to show you my ingredients these amazing popsicles in a bag of eggnog or rompope these are the ingredients i have i have concentrate color flavor of eggnog little baggies granulated sugar evaporated milk condensed milk the eggnog or rompope whipping cream and water this is everything we need to prepare this amazing and delicious and creamy popsicle in a bag of eggnog. So let's get started. And now I want to show you how I prepare my simple syrup. I'm going to need one cup of granulated sugar, one cup of water. And now I am ready to put it here. I'm adding my granulated sugar, adding my water, and from here, let's take it to the stove. We are going to cook it for about five minutes until the water is crystal clear. When the water is this way, we're going to turn off the heat. We're going to let it rest. And then we are ready to continue with this amazing recipe. Look at this. This looks perfect. Nice and clear. And here, I want to start with my simple syrup. I'm adding a little bit in here. I'm going to add my condensed milk. I'm going to get everything from the can. Of course, I'm not leaving anything behind. I'm going to continue adding the evaporated milk. Once you add your evaporated milk, don't throw the can away. I'm adding the whipping cream. And now I'm just going to whisk until everything is incorporated. All the milks are incorporated completely. This really doesn't take too long, but this is a very important step. Once this is done, let's taste it to see if we need to add a little more of the simple syrup. But to my tasting, this is perfect. I have here the eggnog extract and I'm adding two tablespoons of the eggnog extract. This really smells amazing the concentrate is just perfect and now i am ready to use the evaporated can i'm going to go ahead and add the rompope or the eggnog you decide what you have at home okay and here i'm going to add one whole can of the rompope or eggnog into this can so that i could add it directly into the mixture of the milks I'm going to go ahead and add it in here. Look at the eggnog. The color is a really bright yellow. And that's exactly what you want. You want your mixture to be almost the same color. So to this, I am going to add food coloring. Yellow food coloring. So that it really gives it that look of the eggnog. Look at this. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and incorporate the food coloring into my mixture of the milk the smell is just amazing the concentrate is so delicious it smells amazing and now this is completely done let me show you how creamy this is look at this these popsicles in the bag come out 
amazing. I am sure you guys are going to love it. Look at this. Look how creamy it is. It really doesn't, doesn't need too much to make this amazing eggnog popsicle in a bag. Look at this. Nice and creamy and the smell just amazing. And here I am ready to show you how I'm going to go ahead and add all this mixture into those little baggies. I have the baggies here. Of course, you can make them large. Of course, you can make them medium or small. You decide. But I like to use this cup because it has the little, the, the, the little edge nice and thin. So it makes it easier for me to go ahead and add it into the baggies. And now I am ready. I am ready to add the mixture into my little bags. The little bags, you could find them at Walmart, any Mexican supermarket. But look at this. Once you add enough of your mixture, just make sure that you twist the bottom really tight. Get the air out. Twist it really tight so that nothing comes out and you don't make a mess in your freezer. They are going to go in the freezer for about one, one day so that they are nice and cold and firm. Look at this. There is no air in there, and now I am ready to make one more. So to give you an example how to do it and how easy it is, I know that it really takes time, but when you make them at home, your family are really going to enjoy this treat, especially for this hot weather. Look at this. You put just enough, and then you twist it from the bottom, getting the air completely out once you twist then it's so easy to tie it and make the little knot look at this give it a try i know that you guys are going to love it look at this well i'm going to continue making the rest one by one and now i am done i am done with my popsicles in a bag i'm going to go ahead put them in here I'm going to take them to the freezer for a, overnight. I'm going to take them overnight, and then I'll show you when they come out of the freezer. This is the next day. They are nice and cold, nice and firm. And now let me show you what I do. I li like cutting this little edge out so that it looks much nicer. Look at this. Look at this. They look amazing. The color is just perfect, just exactly like the rompope mixture. And now I'm just ready to go ahead and take the little stems off of every single one. And of course, after I take the stem off, then I am ready for the presentation. I can't wait to enjoy them. So I'll see you in just a little bit. My friends, I am completely done with these amazing eggnog popsicle in a bag. Look at this. These eggnog popsicles in a bag are perfect for this hot weather. I hope you give it a chance and you make it at home. Your family are going to love them. Look at this. They look amazing. They are nice and cold. Enjoy them with your family. 
If you liked and loved my recipe, I invite you to subscribe, leave me a thumbs up, share this video on social media with your friends, with your relatives, so Cooking with Gloria keeps growing. Don't forget to push that notification bell. And if you did, leave it activated. So every time I make an amazing recipe like I did today, yes, you're going to be notified. Before I say I see you soon, I wish you nothing but the best. Peace and love. I love you guys.